What's going on everyone? This is Rob from 99 Ways Crypto. Just wanted to do a real quick video here in preparation for the upcoming changeover to the new Detonator UI and a few of the changes. So I've just jumped over to the uh, Detonator white paper. This is the updated version. So this white paper is going to basically cover uh, the contract and how it works the taxes, the payout prizes, the largest deposit, the daily lottery prize, multiple lottery winners, and um, the, a new win, win it now prize, um, and also the maximum earnings, and it covers the time frames for claiming, referral rewards, and the disclaimer, and then finally it gives a sneak peek um, at what will be launched tomorrow the actual new dashboard obviously it looks very similar to to the um where is it over here sorry it looks very similar to the new ui across the whole uh protocol so we just jump back over back over the white paper here so we'll have we'll run through that just quickly before we go now so tomorrow all this will be announced in further detail by aj and his team uh, at the uh, AMA, the tomorrow morning's AMA or tomorrow evening's AMA, depending where you are. Um, and they'll go through uh, it in detail. So I highly recommend that if you have questions that you attend the AMA and ask all the questions you want. So anyway, let's have a look at it. So I'm not going to run through um, the parts that we probably already know from the detonator. Um, and, you know, look, I may miss some things that uh, have changed, but uh, just reading from reading this myself, I just wanted to talk about a few of the changes and, and you know, get your thoughts, your comments below and whatnot. And let's, um, you know, get let this video drum up a little bit of support and hype. So don't forget to like, share and subscribe. One of the major changes um, of the detonator contract is the largest depositor prize. So let's just quickly read through that and um, have a little bit of discussion about it. So the first part outlines how snipers essentially out, try and outbid each other for uh, to be the largest depositor um, each day. So the next one is that the largest depositors calculations include all deposits made by that wallet in the 24-hour rollover period, not just one single deposit amount. So here is the kicker. The prize amount reflects the deposit amount, whereas before you would always win 1% of the total pool balance regardless of the, the deposit amount. The largest depositor now has the ability to win a total of up to 3% of the pool balance by depositing larger amounts. There is a minimum prize amount of 300 LP and a maximum prize amount of 3% of the pool balance. So if you end up being the largest deposit prize winner, then you then your winnings will be based on the amount that, that you have entered into the contract. So no longer will you get 1% of the pool balance, but you can win up to 3% of the pool balance by depositing, depo by depositing larger amounts. Okay, so the harder you go, the better you'll be rewarded. Um, but either way, even if you only put five LP, not this would happen these days, but it has happened in the in the past. Um, even if you just put LP five LP and you were the largest depositor that day, you would still earn up to three hundred LP. Is my understanding. Give me your thoughts on that. Comment down below. I'd love to know what you think of this new change. Okay, this is the one that. Um, intrigues me the most obviously um, because I'm not the type of guy that plays the largest deposit prize um, but I rely on the lotto winning the lotto one day all right let me just read through this one at the time of the roll of the lottery winner of the day is drawn the lottery prize amount is determined by the amount of the winning largest deposit the larger the deposit the larger the lottery prize so in other words if uh, Joe Blow puts in a very large deposit. That means that if you're the lottery winner, you will win a greater prize. If someone won it on the day that is um, a low LP deposit, then your prize will be lower. Remember, there's a minimum of 300 LP anyway. I mean, I wouldn't mind 300 LP. 
the prize amounts for both largest depositor and the lottery are equal to the largest deposit amount on the day, up to their respective maximums mentioned above. Okay, multiple lottery winners. Wow, this is an interesting one. As the pool balance grows, the amount of LP and E in the max 1% lottery prize will grow. The lottery prize will be split among multiple winners as outlined below. Remember that it will still be dependent upon the largest depositor amount as well as the max 1% when there are multiple winners. Total prize pool will be distributed evenly amongst the winners. So the lottery prize is up to, from up to 599 LP deposited. It will mean that there will be one winner. Yeah, the lottery prize is is up from 600 to 999 LP, then there will be two winners of the lottery. The lottery prize from 1,000 to 1,399 LP would equal split of three winners. The lottery prize from 1,400 to 1,799 LP will equal four split winners. The additional winner will be added for each 400 LP increment. So, for example, lottery winners and largest deposit winners are rewarded. And these, these examples here are awesome. Um, example one, lottery and largest deposit minimum price. The pool balance is 100 LP. The pool balance is 100K LP. The largest depositor of the day is 225 LP. Then there will be two prizes for the largest depositor and lotto winner are 300 LP each, which would be the minimum because it's under the threshold. The example two lottery prize matches the largest deposit prize. So the pool balance again is 100K LP. The la this is all it's based off. Largest depositor of the day if is say, let's say it's 450 LP, then two prizes for the largest depositor and lotto winner are 450. So, and so on. So basically they're split splitting it up um, based on the size of the deposit. So the greater the deposit, the more split there is between multiple winners. I think, personally, I think this is a great um, a great change because it will allow, um, it'll allow multiple winners, which gives you, obviously, more chances to win, which I think is great. So if somebody has deposited a large amount and you have to split that, you're still earning well over um, 300 LP, at a minimum. Now I can imagine what 300 LP would do for me and my family, that's for sure. So I think multiple, more opportunities to win the lotto is going to be better than trying to win that one big one of say, what is it at the moment, 100 LP. I'll, you know, is it 100? No, 1000. I would take 300 LP over the odds of trying to win 1000 LP, which it probably the current price is now. I would take that any day of the week because 300 LP, 300 LP for me um, would, would go a long way in this protocol. So I think this is a fantastic idea um, and, and I'm pretty stoked, uh, pretty pumped up about it. And uh, I'm looking forward to this change. So again, you know, look, none of these changes would have been taken lightly. Um, AJ and his team think these things through th very thoroughly and try and get fairness. Um, you know, I believe that they really do try to look after the little guy as well as, you know, looking after obviously people with big money as well. So, you know, it's great. These, these ideas are great for these, these ideas are great for us little binos. Anyway, it goes on to, it sounds like it's got a win it now button of 2% of the detonator pool balance. Um, I'm not sure about this one. I have to probably really ask a few questions tomorrow to probably deeply understand this one a bit more before I get involved in that one. All right, here's the detonator contract dashboard. Um, so it's got some ex explanations. So make sure you get in here and do your own research and have a look at the the um, the new um, have a look at the new UI interface. Have a look at the interface so that it's. Um, you get familiar with it, but it looks really good. It looks like there's a lot more um, interaction and a lot more uh, understanding of around the daily burst because there's been a lot of questions around the daily burst recently. So, uh, yeah, so that, this is looking really good. You know, obviously, we'll tie in with the others. But look, 
Um, I'm sure there's going to be some other videos out there that will go further in depth than this because I, I don't have any alpha on this. I'm sure there's guys out there that AJ and his team are giving um, plenty of alpha, um, you know, in the lead up to this so that they can, you know, um, get these videos out tomorrow. And, you know, I, I haven't been privy to any information, any, any alpha here, but like I said, I'm sure there's plenty of plenty of YouTubers that they've dropped this information to, so stay tuned for other videos uh, that will probably come out tomorrow uh, that will support the this, that will support this change. Anyway, so I just wanted to drum up a little bit of hype and, and uh, thought I'd chuck out a little quick video for you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you share it if you can. Share it, like, and as always, subscribe. And this is Rob out. See you in the next one. Cheers.